Hey, buddy. Huh? Get the f back. Yo, get back, dude. Seriously. I'm over here trying to text and then that beat just come on thumping. Nigga, let me chill. There's no ends in this game. It's all Yiggas. Yiggas. <laughs> Yiggas. Cause they Yakuza's bro. Alright. What? Good job! Welcome back, A, hey, to some more Yakuza Zero. My my plan is to always play this game more frequently, but when I get when I just get to going, I don't know. You know, I just like to play what I like to play. What what's up? What's up? What's the fuck I thought? Why he why he walk up on me? That's the only reason I press him like that is because he walked up on me. I'm not a I'm not a bad guy. How much? Oh no, your breath stinks, shawty. How am I supposed to date her and her breasts smell like dick? I can't do it. Where am I even going? This is not the route. I hope you're having a great day. Her breath didn't smell like dick, but I mean, if it did, I wouldn't put it past her. She just needed a breath mint and nobody told her yet, so. All right, I don't really know exactly where I'm supposed to be doing right now, but I'm sure once I get to my destination, I'll know. So let's just get there first, right? Yeah. Uh, I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight. I want plot. No fights, just plot. Wait, aren't y'all the boy band? Ain't that the boy band? Oh, fake ass. Ain't that the boy band? Is that why that, that is, it's on the market like that? Oh, no, no, no. Oh, f you asked for this. Remember that. Get up. Uh-huh. Okay, you got your boy back. I respect it. Get the f*** out my way. Get the f*** out my way. Oh, yeah. Come here. Get the f*** out my way. You still here? Get the f*** down. Now, what was I trying to see? The boy band left. Whoa. Okay. I didn't know there was more. Come on. Forget how fucking violent this. Okay. Okay. Come here. Come to me. Come with me. Okay. Well, here. Take this instead. You're not getting a bottle of mystery liquid. Man, get up and, and come here. Come, come taste this brick. Oh, you lucky I don't have enough uh, enough heat. Uh, enough heat. Heat gauge. Heat gauge. What was that move? That was kind of cool. I'm gonna do that more often. All right. So are you saying that we can't go move, Nelson? Oh my gosh. All right, we're here. We're here. We're here. Just needed a quick battle to warm me up, and now I'm warm. Let's get the story going. You think this is a joke, pal? Hmm? What's that guy on about? Sounded pretty pissed. A fight going down uh, over there? Majima. Head honcho. Okay. What kind of ass clown goes on a raid with a big honking sword like this, you moron? Does she got any daggers or guns? You know, normal weapons? You can't see the appeal of a Chinese broadsword? This is why I was hesitant to sell it to you. Huh? You're making this about me? Awful cocky for a two-bit black market front. Whole point of business is giving your clients what they want. Sounds like an arms deal. This ain't something I want to get involved with. I deal only with clients I respect. If you would prove that you are worthy of my weapons, undergo my test. Huh? Test? The hell you want about now? 
you and I will spar. Defeat me and you pass. I'm getting real tired of your high and mighty talk. Fine. You want to fight, I'll take you. Say you like your precious can opener when I'm using it on you. Indeed, that's the point. This is a test of your proficiency with the weapon. Ha! <laughs> I ain't gonna feel sorry when you lose an armor if I straight up end you. Am I gonna watch or I get an egg? Oh yeah, I'm just watching. Oh my gosh. Golly! Bro, relax. Fuck it. Alright. That's brain damage. He'll never be the same past 45. Okay. Oh, he just learned something. Okay. A little staff work. He learned how to work that... I'm not even finna say it. Gotta stay one step ahead, you know? Motherfuckers love clipping. The hell are those moves with that stick? That's no martial art I ever seen. But he's got the other dude's sword looking like a damn chopstick. S -s Son of a bitch! You fail. Oh? Uh -huh. Yeah. Well, what'd you expect? Giving me a shit sword like this? That staff you got's a way better weapon. This is merely a piece of lumber. The sword you hold, on the other hand, is a masterwork I painstakingly crafted. What? But apparently you are unfit to wield it. I would ask that you do not return to my shop again. Huh? To hell with your damn shop! I hope it burns with you in it! Rumor said you were the dealer to beat, so I went to the bother tracking you down, and for what? You fraud. Damn. Shit. I've just been staring. I don't want to get dragged into someone else's dirty deal, and I'm out of here. He already heard you. He already knows you're there, bro. Trust me. Whoa. Oh, my gosh. Ah, Majima. Curious meeting you here. Oh, it's you. Yo, don't spook me like that, Gramps. I was merely wandering about in search of a place where the two of us could spar uninterrupted. That's so. Well, the Riverside's occupied at the moment. A real nasty customer at that. His name is Fehu, a local arms dealer. Quite the master himself, too, so long as a weapon rests within his hands. What? You know that guy? I knew his father for ages, back when he walked this earth. Checking in on him was half my reason for coming to Sotenbori. As long as we're all here, why don't I introduce you? Hey, I didn't ask for any favors. Oh, don't be so stubborn. This will be good for the both of you. How do you figure? Besides, the time to sneak off has long passed. It seems Fei Hu has been aware of your presence from the start. What? Apologies, Kamiki-san. But I do not trust this man. He has an air of danger about him. Now, don't you go being stubborn on me too. Delay no longer and put him to the test. I can tell you already, this young man will most certainly pass. Say what? Why the hell do I gotta take a test? I got no business with this guy's shop. Come, come, Majima. I saw that look on your face as you bore witness to their fight. A look of inspiration. And now your silence speaks volumes of truth. That curiosity of yours is one of the keenest tools in your armory. Yeah. Nothing fancy enough to call inspiration. Just a few dumb thoughts rattling around. Yes, but what if they were enough to match Fehu's skill? They would be less dumb, straight thoughts, and more akin to a full-blown revelation. He's like, bro, what? Whether you give that revelation life or snuff it out is your choice. Care to at least give it a try? Uh, Faye, listen, I've had a long ass day and I'm tired as a dog. Let's make this quick. I assume you have no objections, Faye. You. If you recommend him so strongly, very well. It is settled then. Now, what'll it be? The man is an arms dealer. He can procure for you almost anything you might want. Hmm. 
Nah, I'm good with that beat up old bat over there. Huh? A baseball bat. I'm about to show you what the, why they call me um head honcho. I'm about to show you why they. I thought it was a cutscene. I'm about to show you why. I'm about to make it do what it do. Watch me. This should be quite an entertaining match. Steady now. Begin. I don't need no bat. Watch what I do. Slugger style. Try mastering the strong defensive potential that a bat offers. When you use when you guard using a weapon, you are less likely to be staggered by an attack. I'm whooping your ass still. Oh my gosh. Come on, hurry up, okay. Okay. Ugh! Home run! I charged it up too. That's like a smash attack. Easy enough. Let's keep moving though. I certainly did not expect you to use a bat so well. You're quite the interesting fellow. Ah. Just remember using one back when I was running raids on the competition. I think I've improved since then, though. Surprised me, too. I knew you could fight, but I did not think of a spur-of-the-moment selection like that would get you far against Feihu. Shows what I know. So, uh, Feihu, right? What did you think of my bat work? Hi. Pause. You pass with flying colors, of course. You are precisely the sort of person my business exists to serve. Your weapon shop, you mean. Oh, sorry. Your weapon shop, you mean? That's nice of you to offer, but as you've seen, I ain't really interested in the conventional stuff. <laughs> so much the better. I'm not a common dealer pawning off weapons I've scavenged. Well, that's cryptic. What do you mean? Cryptic. What's good, bro? Are you free at the moment? My shop is quite close. I would enjoy the chance to escort you there and explain exactly what it is we do. Uh oh. I feel like he's gonna show me some guns too. Hi. <clears throat> Sorry, y'all. This is our shop, the Dragon and Tiger. Outwardly, a Chinese restaurant operated by myself and my wife. Yeah? This is my wife, Long Hua. Mm. New customer, yes? Many happy returns. And? You said it wasn't your average weapon store. What exactly is it then? Hi. Most of the products we sell here are meticulously hand-forged by me. Bespoken arms, you might call them. Made to order, huh? So you ain't an arms trader. You're a smith, is what you're saying. Precisely. Now, if I may, I would like to explain how it is I go about making weapons. At the Dragon and Tiger, you can enlist a host of agents to locate weapons, gear, and other equipment. They can be hired to hunt down the following three ca- No way. Put the agent's skills to use and gather the world's most powerful weaponry and What the f***? So you send these agents around the globe looking for rare materials and such? That is pretty different. Hi. Our goal in all this is to develop a robust network with arms dealers that work the world over, but some agents' work takes them far from civilization. So basically, you get these guys searching for treasure out in the jungle and shit. I'm, I'm all about that, actually. Indeed. Remote archeo ar ar archaeological sites produce some of the most beautifully wrought and historically important weaponry. My shop is always on the lookout for such gems. Furthermore, customers whose contribute contributions I cannot read right now. It's late, y'all. I'm sorry. Furthermore, customers whose contr <laughs> contributions past a certain level are given a special reward: private arms lessons. Yeah. So I'm guessing that means you were holding back when we fought out when we fought out there. Naturally, that was only a test. <laughs> You're one slippery ill. Uh, 
speaking of fish, I just remembered I ain't ate yet. I'm half starved to death here. You said this place is a Chinese spot by day, yeah? Give me the house special, would you? Oh yeah, you customer for that side of business too? You wait, I fix you a feast. A feast. A feast. Majima, there is a favor I would ask of you. What now? I don't need to tell you not to spread word of their business, but I'd also ask you to keep vigil over them. Why's that? That happy couple in some kind of trouble? I cannot share the details now, but in time their shop may draw the ire of a terrible foe. What's that supposed to mean? Nothing to worry yourself over just yet. I ask only that you drop by when you think of it. Perhaps buy something. Send them out on a search. That sort of thing. Yeah. Alright. I'm headed into the wilderness to train. Don't go letting that edge of yours dull, either. He got on the Kanye West. Kanye be wearing some big ass boats lately. But they're cool. You know. I can't hate on a man who makes his own shoes. Who is that move? Oh, so we just headed home, so... Alright, I guess we call into the night. Who the fuck is this? ダリアマ。おでっせの門やって言うたら心当たりあるやろ。おうしい。おでっせ。望みの引き抜きなら山形と話はついとるで。支配人が納得しても俺らが納得するか。Okay. All right. Y'all know I just learned a new style, right? Anta, お客様は神様やいうて客に土下座までするらしいやないか。夜の帝王かなんか知らんが、なっさげない話やで。そんなに金が欲しいかな。ま、たまに。お客様は神様。Oh. <laughs> うちの店に来た客になら土下座でもするし靴でもなめたるわ。わお。せやけど。客やないなら話は別。まして喧嘩売りに来たチンピラなんぞに俺が優しいと思うな。大層な口聞けんのも今のうちや。かま。やってまい
I got some for you too. I know I don't. It's all out. All right. All right. All right. I'm, su I'm switching styles for this dude. I'm switching styles. Let's do this. You want to fight like a thug? Let's fight like a thug. Okay, I'm, th I'm throwing hands with you still. Okay. Whoa, whoa, that looked demonic. Move! I'm not trying to see him look at my soul like that. No. <laughs> お前ら仕返ししたかったら店に来いや。客としてなら道下座でも何でもしたるわ。ダメ。<laughs> yeah. However, what the fuck is she talking about? I'm like, sorry, I had to do it to you. I'm going to bed. Hold up, Majima. What they doing in your house, bro? Okay, you walking in like like everything's normal, bro. You own one of the cleanest nightclubs in the whole city, and this is how you this is how you rest. So you gotta be grateful for what you got, I guess. You don't care. He just want to be a thug again. What is he looking at? Who the fuck is that? Dr. Eggman? Whoa, who was that? Oh, they case in my house. Somebody might be in here right now. What the fuck is this? Are they waiting on something right now? Majima, you didn't you didn't clear your house, bro. Okay, no, you just tripping right now. There ain't no way that old man is in on this. Keep walking, sir. Never mind. Okay. I was, I was just speculating. That's the thing. Y'all be thinking I'm just stupid or something, but I'm just speculating. What could potentially be happening in real time? I could have stayed quiet and then just acted like I knew exactly what he was talking about. But I just, you know, stream of consciousness. Just blurting out of my mouth. Chapter four, proof of resolve. Let's do it. Three years ago, Kamurocho. Oh, Yodai. おう。ああ。ムーブ。マガイモンは一切なし。同時マグミ経由で仕入れた正真正銘の本門や。拳銃は全部で6丁。1丁につき6発撃ってるとして36発発射できる。Damn. 三十六発か。相手は上野義晴とその場にいる清和会の連中全員。あ、he was あなたと佐江島は今日出所直後の上野義晴を都内のラーメン屋で襲う。そういう計画ですよね。実はあの計画ちょっと問題がありましてね。予定を変更させてもらうことになりました。<笑> 
このまま襲撃に向かえば道島組長いや島野さんにも迷惑をかけることになってしまいます兄弟はもう向かってねえやじゃあ俺はどうしたらいいんじゃま真島さんあんたは俺に兄弟を裏切れっちゅうんかこのまま見殺しにせえっちゅうんか落ち着いて落ち着いて俺は行くたとえどんな裏があっても構わへん俺にとって西島はたった一人の兄弟なんじゃ真島さんでもそれじゃあ,あなたの身もうるさい関係ないわこっちは備えのもんとっくに捨てる払ってきたんじゃそうですかそれじゃ仕方ありませんねおいおおわおしばたがな。親父兄弟は西島はどうなったんですかうん教えてください親父じを外した極道の行き着く先がこの穴ぐらや。Sorry about that, y'all. Ugh, man. Shit, fuck that. Another shit night's sleep. Gotta get to work. Not much else I can do right now. So, all those people that were just looking out of his window, they weren't casing his house. They were watching him. Because of what happened back years ago, they, it, that's what he meant by this city feels like a prison because he's, he's trapped here. He can't get out because of what had happened three years ago. Now he's just kind of doomed to work this job. Which is a good job, but man, nope. Getting the f out of here. Catch me if you can. Yeah, you'll have to get me next time. I'm out of here. There should not be thugs right in front of my club. Somebody get out here and whoop their ass. I'm the boss. 
Head honcho. Yeah. All right. Good morning, sir. And again, thank you for managing to strike a deal with Odyssey yesterday. Just doing my job. And now it's up to you guys to keep this place on the upswing. Still, that was quite the surprise to wake up to. Why didn't you tell me the two other girls were coming besides Nozami? Two what now? Sure, neither one of is at Nozami's level, but they're both veterans and fantastic draws for the club. With any luck, they'll bring all their old regulars straight to us. We gave up some of our girls in the trade, but there's no denying we came out on top here. Last night's nego- negotiations must have been something to behold. Well, I did a fair bit of research beforehand. Long as you get a little dirt under your belt, you can pretty much wing the West. That may be true for you, sir. It's no wonder they call you the Lord of the Night. Looks like my little talk with Yamagata went better than I thought. Probably could have stuck it to him even harder, though. Get a few more girls out of him. I guess I could have done more research or given the club a better look to get a few more cards in my hand to play with. No sense worrying about it now, though. Now, if this is a good time, I'd like to work out the new shift schedule. Sure. All right. All right, there's that. All right. Oh, was that guy that was in here earlier? The dude that won't let me back in the damn gang. There you go. Do you cousin of Kimajia? I knew. Anta to Saka no Mukrainara. Jibun no Shombe, murder machine. He's like, stop fing with me, bro. I'm not going to be able to get a chin 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 Ashitaba Park, classy spot for a classy guy. No telling what shit he'll pull if I'm late, and I better get moving. Alright, well let's not waste any time and get to that park then. You don't have to walk slow, bro. You own the place. Sprint a little. Move your feet. Hmm, what am I gonna do? Oh, what do I do? Y you Everybody want a piece of, of the Majima Mac. Excuse me. Huh? Er, um, well, th the thing is, you want something from me, don't you? Let's hear it then. Y yes, w what I'm trying to say is, uh, I'm. Listen, w whatever you're chewing, I can take it, spit it out. I. I have a, a favor to ask. Can can you please be my boyfriend? No. You say what? Am I hearing you right? I said please be my boyfriend. Please, pretty please. What? Just like that? Your boyfriend? You mean like you want to be a couple, go on dates, smash? What the hell? Yes, that's exactly it. That's what a boyfriend does. You would be my one and only b boyfriend. Right. Okay, back it up a step or six. The 
heck's with this little lady here? Just run up to me on the street demanding that I be her man? Every girl I meet these days makes me understand them less and less. I gotta get it together. I can't let her know she got under my skin. I'll give her a strong answer like, don't even think you won, little lady. Whoa. There you go. What do you say we start as friends, huh? No, no, I need a boyfriend, not just a friend. Come on now. Let's hear that extra syllable that says you're mine. What? You can't just expect a man to jump straight to the girlfriend step. Gotta be more natural, you know? Oh, darn it. I've left out a few details, haven't I? I should clarify, I guess. I need you to pretend to be my boyfriend, not actually be my boyfriend. Excuse me? Pretend? Hi. Yes, you see, my, my father is visiting from back home and he's demanding to be my boyfriend. For several years now, he's been hounding me to meet suitors he's arranged for me. He was getting so persistent that I, I finally got fed up. And I told him, I, I already have a boyfriend, so back off. I also told him my boyfriend is thin, wears an eye patch, a cool ponytail, and has a dangerous air about him. Kind of like the, the blade of a knife. Why would you give him so many details? And why did you just describe me down to the buttons? I, I never thought I'd have to introduce him to my father, so I just kind of made it up as I went. But then Dad started saying, I have to see if this boyfriend is worthy of marrying you. So, here I am, and I've got a big problem. Okay, I, I get the picture now. I fit the bill, so you want me to act like I'm your man in front of your dad. Wow, you catch on fast. That's pretty much it. If dad finds out I don't really have a boyfriend, he'll force me into an arranged marriage with some strange man I don't even know. Please, nobody else looks anything like you. Could you be my boyfriend for just a little while? I'm so busy. The girl's in a pickle, all right. Who'd want to marry some guy they don't even know and end up spending the rest of their life with them? Fine. You painted yourself into this corner, but I feel your pain. I'll pretend to be your boyfriend. Yes! I'm so glad I... Oh, I'm so glad I didn't lose hope. Huh? Oh, my name is Coca. Please call me Coco-chan. Oh, and sorry, I didn't catch your name. I'm Goro Majima. I see. Then Majima-san, I will address you as Goro-chan. Goro-chan? We just met. That's taking things a little fast, don't you think? Okay, so if I, if I nickname somebody and put Chan at the end, that's kind of romantic? Ugh. No, no. I, I know it's just pretend, but we are in a romantic relationship. We can't be so formal with each other. We have to make this believable. Uh, if you say so. Yes, I do. Well, let's not waste any more time. We should be going, like, right now. Man, fuck this sub story. I just can't say no to women, bro. They got a hold over me. It's gonna be my downfall. Huh? I'm getting exhausted already. And what's this about going? Going where? Come on, try to keep up. We're going to the restaurant where we'll meet with my dad over dinner. The three of us. We're gonna meet him over at dinner. I got nothing to say to your pops, Coco Chan. And make it so we meet, shake hands, and then let me go, why don't you? Bing, bang, boom. Oh no, that won't work at all. Dad won't be reassured unless I show him what kind of a man my boyfriend is. We have to go now, Gorochan. Get a move on. Fuck! I don't know what I was expecting, but here we are. Here we are. Age restriction. Age restriction. You know, uh... Alright. So, Gorochan, this is where we'll meet my father. I only have two requests. Please don't reveal that you're just pretending, and don't anger him. You got it. But what's all this about making him angry? And your dad get pissed off easy? Oh no, he's, he's just stubborn. He's not scary, though. He seems to think I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed, and he babies me more than he should. Underneath it all, he's as good a father as I could ask for. Well... And I suppose it's tough to blame the guy. If I had a daughter like you, I'd be pretty worried too. You see? So if you start saying a bunch of weird stuff, he'll blow his lid and be like, Forget this guy. I'll arrange your next date. 
So let's avoid that. No problemo. So, uh, let's go over my boyfriend's backstory now. Excuse me, I need a backstory? We've been going out for six months. You're a dentist who likes going out on drives and watching movies. And your favorite food is omelet rice I make, okay? Uh, what was all that now? I had to give my dad some details about my boyfriend, so I made some stuff up. If he gets curious, can you make sure you've got it memorized? Well, you ain't exactly making this a walk in a park. How am I supposed to remember all these details? Fine, from the top. We've been going out for six months. You're a dentist. You like going out on drives and watching movies. And you love the omelet rice I make, okay? I'll give him my best shot. There he is! Dad! Over here, Dad! Who am I meeting with? Oh, brother. So, this is Coco Chan's dad. Unlike his space case of a daughter, he seems pretty buttoned up. Goro Chan, this is my father. Hello, I'm Coco's father. Pleased to meet you. And this is the man I'm seeing, Goro Majima san. You know, now that I think about it, Meeting a girl's dad for the first time is super important for a couple. This could end up making an impact on the rest of her life. Guess I better buckle down and get into this role properly. No different than at the Grand, right? Nice, Majima, I like that. First impression is key. What do I open with? <laughs> Fuck. Pleased to meet you, sir. I'm Goro Majima. Majima Kun. Whoa, that's, that's fucked up, dude. I'm just playing. Was it? I understand my daughter looks to you for a lot of support. Support? I don't know. In fact, it's quite the opposite. Coco san has stood by me at every turn. Well, how courteous of you. Something that gets me, uh, to. Something that gets to me these days is the uh, erosion of courtesy in today's youth. So many can't even manage a proper introduction. You seem different, Majima Kun. That's right, Dad. Goro chan's not like those stereotypical men. Good. The first impression went well. Oh, sorry. Playing the respectful type was a pretty slick move. Majima Kun. I must say, I'm surprised. You really do exist. I beg your pardon? Well, my daughter described you as a man who is tall yet slender waisted. Sports an eye patch, has long hair tied back, and emits a deadly aura, not unlike a dagger's edge. I never imagined such a man could actually exist. Yet, here you are, in the flesh. See, Dad? I told you I wasn't lying. My boyfriend's right here in front of you. Yes, I figured he was another figment of your overreactive imagination. So I'm uh, really quite shocked. Huh? Overactive imagination? Dad, I don't make things up that often, do I? <laughs> well, they do seem to be on good terms. And her dad's a decent guy, too. Stern, but decent. Oh, yes, Majima kun. Kokoa may have mentioned it already, but what line of work are you in again? My job, huh? Oh, man. I think Coco mentioned that the backstory. Come on now. I manage a cabaret. I'm a dentist. Oh, yes, yes. That's right. I'd heard you're a dentist. I never would have guessed from your appearance. Not the face I'd expect from a dentist at all, to be frank. Oh, at all, to be frank. I get told that often, yes. Oh, Dad, you're being so rude to my Gorochan. Phew. Just glad I remember what Gorochan told me in that hack job of a backstory. Incidentally, Majima kun. Yes. I was wondering, how did you come to meet Kokoro? Well, that's... Uh, 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 uh. I didn't ask you. I asked Majima-kun. But... Tell me, Majima-kun. How did you two get to know each other? What the f... He's prying pretty deep. Is he on to us? Gotta explain how I supposedly met Koko-chan in a way that will make him more suspicious. We happened to sit next to each other at a movie theater. That's how we met. At a movie? Come to think of it, 
Cocoa did mention that you enjoy the movies. You know what's crazy about meeting people? Now, I'm not one to be like... Like, when I'm out in public, I'm not one to be... Like, like really, like, checking for chicks like that. Like, of course, I'm looking. Like, I'm always looking. Don't get me wrong. I'm always looking. I'm always scanning for cheeks or pretty faces. But my... Like, I, like I never, I never approach. Like, like I'm never one to be like. If I see somebody in a movie sit next to me, I'm not gonna look over and be like, "Nice to meet you." See, that was a terrible approach. I'm not gonna sit. Let me try again. I'm not gonna be like, "Yeah, how you doing? My name is Berlin. What's yours?" I never would do that. Something just don't feel right about doing that. Like cold approach on the street, never. But if you hear about most couples or like most married couples. They, they meet just like this at the bank, at the grocery store, at Walmart, at the movies, at church. Like, all it really takes is a hello, how are you doing? But even, like, I don't know, the nerves, even me, bro, I'll be getting nervous. Like, if I see a, a chick that's, like, super duper bad in public, in person, oh, bro. I just hope, I pray and hope to God that she just gave me the right eye contact and that right vibe for me to walk up and be like, what you looking at? Hopefully that works, but most, nine times out of ten that won't work. So just start with the high first. Tell her your tell her your name. Ask her for her ask her for her name. And when she tells you, it say, "What you doing here?" Then that should work. Yes, like I said, Coco Chan just happened to sit next to me. That flick was a real tearjerker, so I offered her my handkerchief, and the rest is history. Yes, that's how it went. Amazing, girl, Chan. I can't believe you can't. I, I mean, I. I remember like it was 15 minutes ago. It was so romantic. Well, what a f- <laughs> meeting then. I'm just glad she didn't meet her boyfriend in any places she shouldn't be. Of course not. My girl Chan is a proper and decent man. There, I wove in Kuggle Chan's backstory and came up with the tale that rings true enough. Majima kun, I'm going to put it to you straight. What is it about my daughter that you find attractive? Dad? Why would you put him on the spot like that? I'm sorry, Coco, but I'm just so worried about you. You're still so innocent. Like a child. It keeps me awake at night. Worrying about whether or not you'll ever manage to live a proper and prosperous family life. If there's a man who would love you and treat you well, why? I will give you my blessing for a marriage right this instant. Dad? uh, That's why I need to ask, Majima Kun. What about Coco? What do you find attractive? He's looking into my soul here. Guess I can't blame him. His daughter's future is on the line. I don't like tricking him, but I told Coco Chan I'd go along with this. Gotta find a good reason why I find her so attractive. Ugh! I fell in love with how great the omelet, <laughs> the omelet rice she makes is. Oh, I must agree with you there. Her omelet rice has a special quality to it. I love it too. But Majima-kun, if that's all you see in my daughter, I don't want to give her away to you. If it's delicious omelet rice that you want, you could just as easily marry a cook. But, Dad. Damn it. Tapping into Koko-chan's backstory backfired. From her dad's point of view, he'd want a guy who appreciates his daughter fully, not just for her cooking ability, I mean, obviously, but I'm sleepy. Oh, would you two excuse me? I I need to go wash up. Uh, sure, honey. Don't fall in. Did I just blow it? It's awkward. Wait a second. With the powder in her nose, it's down to just me and her old man. Damn. Awkward. Majima-kun. Yes? I have no idea who you really are. But thank you for playing along with my daughter's lie. Huh? Her lie? Nope, gonna play dumb. I got no idea what you mean. What lie? (laughs) You can stop pretending. I knew this was all an act from from the moment I sat down. Was it that obvious? If you knew from the start what gave us away. I could tell just by the way my daughter was acting. I wasn't her father for all those years for nothing. 
Then why'd you go along with this dumb charade for so long? Hmm. Kokowo was so desperate to convince me. It's my fault she tried to stunt like this, isn't it? I'm sure it's because I kept pushing her into dates with all those suitors I'd arranged for her. You know your daughter well. You saw her right through her. I lost my wife when Kokowo was still an infant. Oh, wow, they're doing the music too? Ooh, I'm sorry, so sorry I had to do it to you. Coco, well, you was my little baby. I was trying to get you and get married, take you to a little fairy prairie. Something kind of scary is in my pants for the honeymoon. We gonna do our dance. You gonna come to? Whoa, she gonna come to? Yeah, I'm a nasty nigga. I lost my wife in Coco. I raised her alone without anyone's help. I tried to raise her well, so no one would look down on her for not having a mother. But I know I've been overly protective of her. I can see now that she's capable of standing on her own two feet. I've got to stop telling my daughter to do this or that. No more pushing her to meet potential suitors. She's her, her own woman. It's time I learn to let go. But the truth is, there's another reason I went along with your little charade. What's that? Someday, my daughter's going to bring a real boyfriend to meet me. And I thought this might be good practice. Practice, huh? Thanks to you, I've I got a good idea of what to expect. And when the time comes, I think I'll manage. Ah, still ain't a good feeling to spend so much time lying to someone who knew it from the start. But I gotta tell you, I think avoiding an arranged marriage wasn't the only reason Coco Chan pulled the stunt. What do you what do you mean? I think she was trying to show you that you don't need to worry about her so much. Worry? Yeah! Pretty plain to see that she's the source of a bundle of your worries. I think she wanted to reassure you that she's capable of looking after herself. She wanted to prove to you that she can manage her own affairs. Like getting married. S Sorry, I'm back. I hope that wasn't too awkward for you guys. <laughs> Did you even break the silence? <laughs> Welcome back, Coco Chan. So, listen, your dad actually knew. Majima kun. Yes? Coco, you've done well finding this man. Uh, I had nothing to worry about, after all. Dad. <laughs> I know, right? Girl Chan's a super guy, so this means you'll stop trying to set me up, right? Yes. Uh, I can see there's no longer any need. Really? Awesome! It's, it's been an awfully long day. Uh, I'm heading back to my hotel. Oh, okay. I'll walk you back, Dad. This sub story is cute. I kind of fuck with it. I, I, I like, you know, I love the emotional shit, man. I'm all about that. Goro chan, thank you so much for being my boyfriend for even just a few minutes today. Goro chan, I think you did an excellent job pretending to be my boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> Glad to hear it. I wanted to give you this. Thank you. You got five pieces of floor, right? What is that, drug? Come on, bro. Whatever the case, I think I'm free from my dad hounding me to meet his suitors. What a relief. That's good. Yes. Well, I have to walk my dad to his hotel. Yep. When you get a real boyfriend, you better do a proper introduction so he doesn't have to worry about you. Hi. I'll try. Bye now. Kokoa. Uh, I forgot something. Give me just a moment. Okay. Hmm? 
know, something wrong. Majimakum. There's one last thing I, I need to say. Huh? What's that? Majimakum. I'm glad I got to talk to you. You went through all the bother pretending to be my daughter's boyfriend. Just for my sake. You're a good man. <laughs> I was trying to put one past you. Don't give me too much credit now. No, no. Not at all. That's why. I'd like it if you would be my daughter's real boyfriend. What the fuck? Oh my gosh. Bruh. This game... This game... Needs a show or something. This is like an anime I'm playing, bro. The music, the, the characters, this is... This is A1. Excuse me? What, what, what did you just say? I said, won't you please ask my daughter out for real? Consider it for a moment. Please. What in the fuck makes you think that's a good idea? Because you're the ideal man. I think I can safely entrust her future to you. Whoa, slow down, slow down. I'm having trouble believing my ears. You could start by just pretending. That's fine. Heck, if she won't, if she won't take you, I will. I will. Did you just say what I think you did? Yeah, Dad. What's all this about? Give me a break, you two. What the fuck? This is why I'm single. Facts. All right, that's the sub story for the week. Everybody else is getting denied. She lucky I even did that much for her. All right, so let's get back. Let's get back to our quest. No. Golly. No. <laughs> I'm sorry, Majima. Golly, this street is just active tonight. Oh, you took it that way? I, I, I see, I see. But no, that's not the right answer. Uh, I don't get it. What's this? A lover spat in public? No, no, no. We'll do all these in live stream, y'all. The street too lit right now. I need to get to the to the quest. I get to keep all these sub stories until the until the um the chapter is over. We just started chapter three, so I get a live stream going and we'll check that out. Oh, he got bread. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. How much do I have? Oh, I need that. I need that. Huh? I need that, homie. Oh my. He looked like my cousin Brandon. Hey, you with the eye patch. Yeah. Give me your money. What? Are you trying to shake me down? Guess I'm getting too famous around here for my own good. You famous? Can I get your autograph? Write my name on it too. Noya Kawahashi. So you can brag the folks back home you met some famous you never even heard of? Don't you laugh at me. You don't know who I am either. My crew's 25,000 guys strong, so you better show some fucking respect. Cool story, bro. But if it were true, your little gang would rival the Tojo clan in size. I ain't buying it. I'm not lying. I've got a real reputation back home. Alright, if you say so. So why are you here on your own? The other 24,999 guys run out of gas on the way? I'm a lone wolf, that's all. A lone wolf with 25,000 to comfort you when you get a little lonely? Oh, it's just all the questions. I'm just here in town to have some fun. Fuck, but I needed cash for that, you know? Huh? What? You didn't bring any money? <laughs> why? That's how your voice sounds? Why do that when there's a plenty of it here? So you're just a kid from the sticks who came to the city for a good time. And you're beating folks up for play money? You picked on the wrong city slicker, fuck. Oh, sorry. <laughs> on the wrong city slicker, though. Your little Sotenbury Grand Circle tour is over. You don't want to give me your money without the fight? That, that's a find by me. This motherfucker is huge! Okay. 
Every hit I lose, I lose some cash. He's about to win. He's way more of a problem than I thought, y'all. I didn't know this motherfucker was that strong. I would have just kept walking to my destination. <clears throat> Holy smokes. He's stupid. Oh, I'm, I wasn't supposed to win. Okay. You got shaking. Maybe, maybe I was. I don't know. Fuck. Thanks, loser. Uh, uh, thanks, a uh, loser. Huh? Damn it. I busted my ass during huh? that money. What do I care? If you wanted to back, you're welcome to come back and to try to save a thing on me. Now, where should I spend your hard earned cash? At the uh, Pachinko Stopala? At the Pachinko Parlor? Or maybe I should have treated myself to some sweet time with some sweet ass at the cabaret? Why did I just try that? My precious moolah. I can't let this slide! I gotta beef up and get back from him. With interest. I'm really broke. He stole, he stole everything? Dog. What about look like showing up to this meeting with no money? Is that him? Oh, okay, okay, okay. We eat noodles? You know we eating good noodle every day. Over. Alright. Oh. With my guy. That's my guy. That's what I'm going to to こんな文字生だ。10万 <笑> What was on that plate? Tell me right now. Some sake? Oh. Tell them pour you up one and take it, bro. Relax. Thank you. Mmm, hot sake? I'm trying to travel, bro. I gotta travel these next three years. Like, stupid travel before I turn 30. Then when I turn 30, I'm gonna start looking around for some little girl, somebody daughter to come wife. And when I say somebody daughter, I mean 18 plus for sure. Actually, I mean 22 plus. Y'all 18 year olds, y'all kind of loopy still. 30 year old me can't handle that kind of 18 year old stress. F that. I want smooth sailing at 30. 29, I'm still being the top. I'm 26, so I got three more. We really just came here to have lunch with bro? He don't earn my respect yet. Sit here and break bread with bro. Thank you, okay, okay. Oath brother. まあ、わけわかんねえよな。極道の世界で親に逆らった奴は必ず相応の報いを受けるもんだ。破門、絶縁。その辺ならまだいいが、ひでえ時には人知れず殴り殺しにされることもある。お前は穴倉生きっていう、その最悪のケースを踏んじまった
何より一度穴蔵に落としたやつをあのシマノが救うとはなだがシマノがお前を許したかといえばそうでもない穴蔵から出たお前は波紋も絶縁もされずに極道の世界から追放されたそして大門違いの兄弟分である俺にお前を預け敵として飼うように指示をした武闘派と呼ばれるシマノがなんでそんなに回りくどいことをしているのか奴の目的は一体何だろうなさあ俺が聞きたいくらいや<笑>案外理由は単純でただ単にお前のケツの味が忘れられないだけなのかもしれねえな What? なんだよ、つまんねえやつだな。そうだ。一つお前に聞いてみたかったんだ。なんでお前、そんなに登場会に戻りてんだ。お前みてえな跳ね返りが、こんなバスに耐え続けてまで。サイジマタイガーだっけかお前が登場会にいた時の兄弟分だっけうん、オーブラザー。Oh, brother. 18人殺しの佐江島大河か。当時は大騒ぎになったもんだ。登場会と敵対していた地元組織、上野清和会の会合に単身襲撃。結果、相手組員18人を射殺したんだからよ。登場会の生ける伝説。こっちでも随分話題になったけどその佐江島も今や無所の中18人もやったんだあとは死刑判決を待つだけだろうなのにお前はそいつのために登場会への復帰を望んでいるそこがわかんねえんだ兄弟は塀の中で死ぬようなたまやないあいつは必ず戻ってくる俺を殺しにな殺しにあ何でもないもう過去の話やとにかく俺は No I need, I need to figure out what happened Hold on one second I'm gonna rewind it on game capture and we'll be right back Okay so they were gonna set his brother up to get murdered but they didn't want him to go He said f that I want my brother and so they kept him there threw him on the ground and then exiled him we don't know I mean my brother's in prison now but why does he feel like Majima's why does Majima feel like his brother's gonna kill him what? So at the kite the guru has more night you'll die even look at you much to get it to a giga told you can you move up the size you know I'm not the kid 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 泣ける話じゃねえかなあ<笑>あんたには関係あらへんまあ俺も大門違いとはいえシマノの兄弟には仲良くさせてもらってるからなでもまあ俺だったら自分の人生の全てを捨ててまで他人のために生きる道を選択する気にはなれねえなお前もいい大人なんだもっと器用に立ち回ってもいいんじゃないのかまあいいやお前が俺に言われて素直に入って言わない男なら分かってるじゃあお望みの本題に入ろうかお前人を一人殺せるか殺しああそうだなんで俺がそないのことを言ったじゃねえか極道に戻れるなら何でもやるってよ違うのかそないなことせんでも俺は店の売り上げあと5億あげて極道に戻るおデッセイから望みを引き抜いてかもう知っとんのかけどさもし俺がおデッセイに連絡すりゃその話今からでもなかったことにできるんだよないんやと<笑>まあつまり Man? What is your deal? Kane mo ke sa sta ue ni Hito mo no shima te tetsudai chun ka Dotchi mo daiji na koto nan da yo 
Ooh, now I just put it a low, what quiet one, and it stink now. Makimura Makoto. Kita got a Wow, Darius. Makoto is the girl Kiryu and Tachibana need to find that owns the, the, the lot that everybody's trying to get to. They're trying to get to her, and this dude talking about kill her. Whoa! Whoa! We've heard about her through that shit too! Through the sub story! あいてが屈で良かったな。やりやすくなっただ。その牧村と男はどこにおるん。それを調べるのも仕事のうちだ。牧村は女たちにテレクラで男を釣らせてる。探るんなら末端の女どもから当たるのがいいだろう。テレク
I'm cool. I don't even want to hear what you got. I'm going to bed. Hmm? I keep telling you we're sold out. But, but please, uh, there's got to be a way. Look, you can wail all you want, but sold out is sold out. I can't magically pull one out from under the counter. Oh, please, I'm begging you. Please, just one, please. One's all I need. Okay, now you're just crazy. If you don't back off, I have to call the police. Oh, no. Don't get involved. Don't get involved. Don't get involved. Save those for another time. It's time for Betty Bye. Time for Betty Bye. That's crazy that some of y'all out there will not know what time for Betty Bye is from. And and look, I don't need the rest of you to tell me that I that that you're not that you're not that young. God dang it. I wanna go to fucking bed, you hooligan bastard. Get up. Oh my gosh. Fucking forward tilt, side tilt by Ganondorf kicked in the face. He said he's not like us. No, I'm not. I'm a beast. I'm a man amongst boys. This little hallway that, that they make you go through to get to your house. Which one is it? Oh my gosh, they're gonna beat my ass before I can even get to the fucking bed. What the f Be cool, y'all. Be cool. Punk ass niggas. What the fu- Oh my gosh. Nigga. I should be grateful for these fights because that's how I'm making most of my bread right now. So, it is what it is. Let's go home now. They want me to put a hit in and get Makoto out of here, do they? The plot thickens. Ooh, that plot thickens. Yeah. I'm so, I'm trying to start to stay awake, bro. I'm just recording so late. It's three in the morning. I'm ending Makoto Maki Makimura. Step one's finding the guy. Sagawa said to try hitting the telephone close for girls in Ma Makimura's ring. Guess it's time to go make some calls. So we're looking for the prostitutes, huh? Just the slimmies, the slutties, the horries, the shorties. Just all of the above.
All right, and here we are at the first one. Let's talk. Wait a minute. Is it her? Yeah, it's gotta be. You got pocket tissues. No, it's definitely not her ass. Move, girl. Do I go in? Can I enter this? I can enter this? Oh, I can. Okay. This is a telephone club. I never heard of that. Welcome. How much time would you like today? Give me two hours. Thank you, sir. Please head down the hall to room number five. Am I about to get age restricted? This is a sex hotline housing house business. He said Makoto Makimura is using college age girls. Hope I can get lucky and find one. Hello? Oh, hi. Hey there. Hey, your voice is pretty damn cute. What are you up to? Now? Just lying around. I'm jealous. You got the day off? The baby finally went down for his nap. Now that I've got my hands free, I figured I'd call in. Housewife with the kid? Fuck that. Guess it'd, <laughs> Guess it'd be too lucky to strike gold on the first call. It's gonna take a while. I'll just keep going. I want to hear his game, though. I like to pick up game from the elites. Ugh. Right. Uh, he said, Damn, your voice sound pretty cute. Hello, welcome. I'm Goro, but I'm Gorou. Who? Akko. Give, give your name first, then ask for the name. Excellent. There's a roach on my desk. All this fucking Japanese candy I was eating. He's like a little baby roach. That's the one thing about Texas that nobody really warned me about was these bugs. They're just fucking rude. No. I want to watch. Whoa, my headphone. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I love it. There we go. Class, we got a college student. Oh. <laughs> Still don't know if she's connected to Makimura. Gotta keep digging here. <笑>元気にやな。飯を持ってくれたら相手は誰でもええんや。<笑> ほんまに。うち、え、If she's interested in tattoos, she's no ordinary student. Might have some criminal connections. I'm running low on time here. Better make my move. What? Makimura Makoto, do you know? Sorry, I'll kill you. Just wait. What? Oh, shit. I'm a writer. 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 
それで牧村藩を知ってる人から話聞きたいなあ思っててなあこちゃん牧村藩のことを何か知っとるんかせやったら超大手話聞かせてもらえへんやろうかああもちろん俺はするで絶対アッコちゃんにも牧村藩にも迷惑かけへんどうやろうかほんまにほんまやほんまわかったせやったら今から岩尾橋に来て岩尾橋やな五郎さんはどんな格好してんのグラさんに黒のジャケット髪や長髪を後ろで結んどる目立つからすぐわかると思うでわかったほな今から岩尾橋で待っとるで絶対来てやそうしたら後で Way too easy. You know, I never went to Homegirl House to train with her. I forget where she lives, but she, the girl who was whooping that dude, that, that group of dudes' asses, I never trained with her. Hey, buddy. Huh? Get the f back. Yo, get back, dude. Seriously. You're the walking erection. Get the f. Oh my gosh, my. You're the manager of the Grand, aren't you, Majima san? What? Um, yeah, that's me. You were enjoying yourself at Odyssey last night, hmm? I saw you there. Surrounded by pretty girls all day, and you still go to a cabaret on your out time? You're a real pwn hound, you huh? huh? Look, that was strictly business. <laughs> hey, no need to hide it. <laughs> and now you're running for the telephone club first thing in the morning? <laughs> you're a hard up, aren't you? Huh? I guess that's how it must look. But wait, what's your story? The fact that you've been everywhere I have means you got business with all these establishments too, don't it? Yeah, three rounds a day just isn't enough for me, so I, I wind up going from spot to spot most days. What? From massage parlor to porn hut to who knows where? Hey, shit, three times a day? That's not enough? How much jizz you got in you, right, bro? I'm sitting there thinking like three times? That shit don't hurt? <laughs> I get asked that a lot. m i c h a e b e t a has a reputation of a. <laughs> But I feel like you and me are in the same boat. Now, don't get me wrong. Three times a day? Three times a day is fine, but consecutively? No way. My shit gonna feel like. My shit gonna feel like I'm peeing through a motherfucking.、Uh, yeah. Acid tube. Over. Alright. Like hell, we are. So, you stopped me for a reason? Oh, we just got the feeling we're birds of a feather, that's all. <laughs> Now we could trade tips. I'm praying you mean info. Yeah, about where the cutest girls in town are. Who's at that shop? Who's good at the shop? That sort of thing. Come on. I'll pass, thanks. I ain't that thirsty. Yeah, it's a real shame, still. There's way more hotties around lately, huh? Some of them put out videos I've been watching for sure. What kind of videos are we talking about? You've been to the private video booths, but right? I'm talking about the soft cores they screen there, like. Ah.、Uh, every time I pass a cute girl on the street, I make a note to check whether she's put a video out. <laughs> God damn, you are one certifiable perv! Hey, I know you think the same thing if you saw some of these honeys. I'll let you know where to find some of my favorites. Go have a look. Maybe if I feel like it. I'm pretty much always in little spots around town. Come find me if you want some fetch recommendations. Yeah, alright. Alright, that's a good b o s s i n g nights. Have a good one. I'm supposed to meet Akko on Iowa Bridge. Guess if I head there, she'll come find me. Alright, well, let's not waste no more time, bro. Talking to fing dingling head. All he c a r e about is busting a nut or two.
That's not that's not a life you want to live, y'all. Like, I know it can sound cool and like, you know, media make it look like it's cool, but you want to preserve your life force. You only got one. You only got one dingling, one 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 seed. And you really don't want your shit to stop working at 40. You want your shit to be working at 65. If you're just stroking it all throughout your teens and 20s, your shit, is, your shit will be f***ing... I'm sorry for telling y'all about... This is a different playthrough. I'm not even finna bring up... Uh, I'm not even finna bring up Chronica Daughter. This is where I'm supposed to meet uh, Akko. I just have to wait and hope she finds me. This is a setup, brother. I'm telling. Okay, maybe not. Fuck. She showed up. Okay. She not talking though. Shit, her guards up sky high. She bills on me, and I'm screwed. Gotta find some way to put her at ease here. Don't ask me. やっぱりこない変装しても分かる子には分かってしまうか。自分の反射も顔が憎いわ。ああ、ええ、ええ、ええ。サインやったら何ぼでも書いてあるから、みんなには。What is this approach? うちの考えすぎか。こないアホな人が例の人なわけちゃうもんね。Alright, and that's the first hurdle cleared. Cool, perfect. The gangsters don't drink tea. Oh, okay. She wants some food. Sushka. やっぱり女子大生ともなるとええもん食うてるんやな。A girl who knows what she wants, excellent. まどき女の子とデートするんなら、予算五万くらいないと話しんだらんわ。五郎さん、社会人ならそれくらい持っとるやろ。当たり前やないが、学生が見たこともないような豪勢な飯食わしたるえ。ほんまに？五郎さん、
っちゅうことはアッコちゃん売りとかしてへんのせやったら悪いけどなんぼおごってもろてもホテルとかついていかんでああちゃうってそういうつもりとちゃうねんただ俺はそういう噂を耳にしたもんやったからほんまにまあそれが賢明やねうちに何かあったら無事で済まへんからあそれは一体どういうはい小肌あおいしそうほないただきまーす This is really a video game. I'm trying to like get information out of her and she's not buying it. And this is a fucking video game. That's fire. Facts. Let her eat. She's gonna open up like an oyster. I had that on me? Oh, because I whooped somebody's ass, thankfully. Imagine I showed up to this shit broke, bro. That dude really got 600,000 yen off me, though. Because I challenged him to a fight. Yo, tell me how to beat him, y'all. Seriously. Oh my gosh, this little girl. Alright, come on. Sega! Ugh. Easy! You know what I'm talking about? Okay, cool. You said you don't? Watch the Twitch highlights. Right now. UFO catcher? What's this? I'm going to take a look at the crane. I'm going to take a look at the crane. I'm going to take a look at the crane. Oh, my God. I'm going to take a look at the crane. I'm going to take a look at the crane. What are you doing? お金で何でも買える思ったら大間違いよねっていうかお金はうちが払うから五郎さん代わりにやってやうちこういうの苦手やねんあなんで俺が誠さんのこと聞きたいんとちゃうのしゃあないなほな一応やったるやないか Is this about to be a mini game or does he just. Oh my gosh. What are the controls? Bro. That's the winner. Give me that. Grab him by the tail.
do this one. Oh my gosh, so I gotta win one of these? The f***ing joke. That's not enough. I didn't go back enough. I didn't go back enough. It's gonna clip right in front of Pikachu fat ass face. Damn! Clip him! で、これが欲しかったんやろ。めっちゃ嬉しい。ゴロさん、ありがとう。ま、ざっとこんなもんや。あ、それで巻物。ま、それもそうやな。オナはどうか。were you thinking like a hookah lounge? This, this, she's trying to make this a real day. I feel like she's just swindling me out of a good time, a good meal. Probably some dingling in a minute. We about to go back to my house. Oh, she's trying to, she, she's trying to get a groove on, okay? She hustling you, bro. She's hustling you, dude. She's hustling you. He gonna be there at the disco watch, ready to whoop my ass. I wonder if it's a setup. I'm sure they got a dress code there, but hopefully this getup will look the part enough. Hurry! Keep up! Faster! Hurry! Faster! What is this, bro? What is this? Dance battle or a fight? He look like a, like, Donkey Kong, did he? He look like Cranky Kong, honestly. <sighs> I think it's a dance battle. Oh my gosh. Ah, Majima. There you are. I wasn't gonna do voices, but then bro showed up. Oh man, Kameki? What? You still out here hunting for a place we can go at it? No. Just out for my afternoon consti constitutional. Ah. Taking in the city. Hmm, you seem troubled. Well, yeah, I, I gotta get across this bridge, but those punks are doing a good job of blocking the way. If they want to break each other's faces, that's fine by me. I just wish they'd hurry up with it. Fisticuffs, hmm? Knowing the rituals of their kind, I doubt things will take such a violent turn. Rituals? What, you know those guys? Judging from their attire, they are practitioners of the new breaking dance. The kids are so fascinated with these days, it is their custom to settle disputes by dancing. Dancing to assert dominance? What are they, some kind of horned up birds? How the hell do you fight with dancing? Just watch. There, look, they begun. Watch their performances closely. I don't need to see breakdancing in Sotenboro culture. Okay. Uh, okay. Now he went in. Oh my gosh. Breakdancing style. Here you see somebody do some shit and he just a straight he just a straight mare like culture vulture clout chaser I'm just playing clout chaser that's hilarious holy that was dancing
I never seen moves that sharp. I wonder if I could pull some of that off. Looks like my oh. win. This bridge is, was, and forever remains property of Arishi Crow. Fine, I keep it for now. But this isn't over. I'm going to up my game and be back for blood. Mmm. Oh, seems the boy in the red frock won. Quite the sight, eh? An intriguing way of establishing pecking order. Yeah, not bad, as street performances go. Playing Koi Majima. How do you mean? Watching them dance sparked something inside of you, did it not? The look in your eyes was hungry. Ravenous, even. And you got eyes like a damn hawk. Yeah, all right. Still, I don't know if I could actually apply it, though. <laughs> That's marvelous news. Another thing to look forward to in our sparring. Sorry, but I'm kind of in the middle of something here, dude. I got I get that you're raring to go with this, but it's going to take me a while, yeah? <laughs> Out on one of these dates with the young lass, are you? You're a formidable man in many area arenas, it seems. What? It ain't like that. Only teasing, my friend. But I have found our venue, Ashitaba Park. The park? Okay, I'll, I'll drop by when I get some time. And I shall be waiting. I will have my training to occupy me until then. Farewell! I whooped your ass when I... Okay. The crowd's clearing out here. Let's hustle to the, to the disco before something else comes up. <laughs> hustle, I will. Move, uh, BTS. <laughs> Glad I pushed X. I do not feel like sitting there watching him breathe hard. Hello, sir. The VIP entrance fee is 30,000 yen. Here, take it. Thank you, sir. Please enjoy your time at Maharia Maharaja. This club lit. Hold up. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. Crowd is weak. Dance floor is still empty. I need a drink right now. Okay, so tell me what you know, girl. You もっと大人数でシャンパー開けてパーッと楽しむもんやで。そんな友達おらんもん。そうなんか。そう意外やな。親と喧嘩して家出するような不良娘と仲良しで止めてくれる子はめったにおらんし。おっても せやからみんな仕方なく街で男捕まえてホテル泊まったりするけどやっぱり危ないことの方が多いし。巻村。せやけど中にはあぶない客もおるやろが。せやからその間の人に会った時はすぐにまことさんのポケベルに連絡入れ
あんたが悪いんやろうち見たんやであんたが飲み物に睡眠薬混ぜてたのそんな男についてくはずないやん何や今日はこの前の男はおらんのかおらんのやったら読んでもかまへんでそんかわりこっちも人連れてきとるからなあんた最低やな This dude is like setting up a rape right now. Like, like I know what you're doing. Yo, Majima, watch this motherfucker. This big ass lizard suit he got on. This lizard Christmas green suit he got on. Just saying, you in the god way. We about to do break dance style. Okay. Oh my gosh. I didn't even hit the park yet. And what if I look stupid and fall on my face? Alright. I thought he was gonna hit the wall. He went. Alright. Breaker style. What the f is this style? Yo, this style blows. What is that? You look like. This look like a joke style, like, like not to be taken serious style. Damn, motherfucker! F Yo, this style is fucking whack. Never using that again. Breaker style is not it. Give me bra give me thug or uh, or the bat one. いつでも例の牧村藩を呼べるとは限らないよ。うん。言うてもまことさん、いつもすぐ近くにおるからな。読んだらほんますぐ来てくれんねんで。そうなの？まことさんな、普段生態師やってはるの。That's what we needed. That's what I needed. That's exactly what I needed. This is goodbye. So long. Farewell. Okay. Ah, Uchi got used to that. So nice to meet you. Goro san, one person, but I taught you that. But Mama and Makoto san, no, not nice to meet you. Definitely not. I know. I know. But I'm really trusting you, Makimura san. Oh, that's right. If that guy wasn't here. うちも今頃どうなってたかわからへんの
そらさすがに褒めすぎとちゃうか女に優しゅうするのもあげない下心あってのことかもしれへんやないかそんなん絶対ないって蒼天堀には誠さんに救われたって子めっちゃ多いんやから男に騙されてひどい目合わされて自殺寸前のところを救ってもらったって子もおったしうちらにとってほんま神様みたいな人やね花ええ人疑ったらバチ当たるわふんあでもただ一つだけ誠さんから頼まれてることがあんねん頼まれてることうんもしお客さんの中でコウモリの入れ墨をした男の人を見たらすぐに教えてくれってコウモリの入れ墨をした男誰なんやそれうちも詳しくは知らへんけど誠さんずっとその人を探してるみたい誠さんから何か頼まれることなんてそれくらいしかないからバイトしてる子はみんな協力して探してるんやわなるほどなそれで最初俺が入れ墨しとる言うたら食いついてきたんかそういうこと女を使って男を探してるのかあっあかんそろそろ次の人と待ち合わせの時間や次やとまだ遊ぶんかほなうちはこれでバイバーイたまにはうちに帰れや気が向いたらなバイバーイ She, hey, she, she living her best life. She living her, she living her best life. Ain't nothing wrong with a little party. Hmm. What's the deal with this bat tattoo? Doesn't matter. Saner scum, I'm killing Makamura. That's the job. Oh my gosh, we are? Yo, shades. No, you're the guy from Iowa Bridge who's duking it out with the big dude with your breakdancing or whatever. Boom, son. I felt that. Huh? The hell are you exploding for? That battle was sick, yo. Those moves got me seriously bugging. I thought I seen the best Soden Bury had to offer, but your skills are at the curb or to the curb. Oh, that's what this is about? Look, I just tried out some random stuff that came to mind. It's nothing. The hell are you talking, man? This is like a bolt from the blue to me. A shout out from God. You gotta join my crew. We need you. Crew, come on. Yeah, I reach your queue with crew. If you join up, we be kings of Sotenberg, no question. I reach the crew name and I reach my name. So, yeah, welcome aboard, dog.、Oh, yeah. Are you nuts? Why would I waste my time playing around with you and your friends? Go find someone else. I ain't playing, fool. Me and my crew, we in this for real. I'm throwing down every day. We gonna take over this town, then Japan, then the world. You feel me? Like. Yeah, that's great. And just how you plan on taking over the world by dancing on the side of the damn street? Hey, lots of folks come through Saltonberry. Entertainment big wigs gotta be in the mix. Yeah, you get one of those cats' attention? Who even knows? I suppose it's not impossible. Got plenty of guys like that coming through my club every night. Wait, I see. If I want the big boys to take notice, I gotta stand out more than anybody else in this town. Do that and get my ass on TV is totally possible. Hmm, that's some plan. I figure into all that how exactly? It hit me while I was watching you battle, dog. We, we take your moves, ill moves, and pump them up the volume up. It will be crushing every other crew in Osaka. I already got ideas for a whole bunch of sick new moves. You get those on your belt, you'll be unstoppable, son. Hmm, can't say I care much about dancing, but I am pretty curious about where I can take this fighting style. And hey, you ain't gotta give me an answer right now. Think on it. We practice in the alley behind Shofukushu West. You decide you in, you come see us, cool? See ya. Alright, sure. Shofukushu West. Maybe I'll drop by. Don't get your hopes up, though. Name's Majima, by the way. Majima san? Tight. We'll be waiting for you.、Uh, you gotta come by sometime. 
E doing all this talking to me, and I got this aggressive ass murder music behind me. There you go the safe spot. You already know I'm about to save, and, and when we get back, I got murder on my mind. Ah. All right, you guys, well, that does it for another episode of Yakuza. Very interesting once you start getting that story going again, man. There's a lot of layers to this shit, and the sub stories are also equally as entertaining. I just feel like I need to take a minute before I play sub stories and maybe do that on live stream or something like that. But if you enjoyed this playthrough, once you continue, make sure you leave a like on that button before you go. Subscribe if you are new, hit notifications so you always know when I'm going live, live, and for more laughs. That being said, I love each and every one of you, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.